Hello everyone. Today I would like to introduce a very useful tool to use when you search medical articles in PubMed. These are called tags. These are all called tags. There are various tags, but these three tags, TI, TIAB, and MH, is my favorite tags. First, TI means title. It's search only in title. So those two terms were included in the title. So this is the result. But when you want to be a little bit more sensitive, you use this tag, TIAB. That means title and abstract. So in case you want the topic dry needling and low back pain, TIAB tag makes you search in the title and the abstract. So even if the term you search it was not included in the title, but if that term is included in the abstract, the result will sh be shown in the search list. The last one is MH. That stands for mesh. These are the mesh term for that article we just saw, dry needling and low back pain. Mesh term is assigned by editors in PubMed. So you can say this is very relevant to that article. Usually, mesh is more sensitive way of searching. But all these three tags make your search make make your search very relevant very specific so i can say that all these tags make your search very specific relevant but among these three tags ti is the most specific way of searching so it is like a telescope lens so you can see the cat's face in detail so this mesh tag makes your search zoomed out to see the big picture. But I told you these all tags make your search very relevant. If you want wider, like a fisheye view, you just type it without any tags. They make your search very sensitive. But I usually do not use that method because that method is not that specific. Okay, here we are with PubMed. Let's search some articles related to acupuncture and low back pain. So I just type the word everything I want in the search window. Actually PubMed automatically created search phrase on their own. So actually what you search it is this long sentence. So they automatically change the acupuncture to acupuncture in all fields. So they found acupuncture, acupuncture and acupuncture in the mesh, acupuncture in all fields, including all the text. And low back pain they translated into mesh term and low and back. So what they show you in the list is different can be different from what you think. So in many cases, just typing all the terms in sequential manner is not a wise way. You can start from mesh. So it makes it will make your search very specific. And low back pain. Mesh. You can just type MH. Either way is fine. So when you search this way, the search result reduced in great number. So I can say your search became very specific. Here you go. So let's see. Is dry needling effective for low back pain? This article title does not include acupuncture, but because of mesh here, they show this article even if the acupuncture term is not in the title, but if you click this article, if you scroll down, you can see what mesh term they used. 
here. These are the match terms the editors assign to this article. Uh, they assign them these topics to this article. So acupuncture is included here, acupuncture therapy, this is the match term. So this article is a very relevant article regarding acupuncture and low back pain. So we found 158. What will happen if we change this mesh tag into title and abstract? Title and abstract. So the number reduced by two. As a writer, you want to include the important terms in title or abstract. So it can be a little bit more specific. So if you, same article, so in a title, acupuncture is not included, but there must be acupuncture in the abstract somewhere here. Uh, dry needling, dry needling, acupuncture. But still, if you think this is the large number to browse, then you can be more specific. So I can say you can zoom in more with a telescope lens just tell it a B and you are searching acupuncture in the title and low back pain in the title so there is no way to be more specific in a search in PubMed so if you see here you your result reduced in half if you br quickly browse it the list you could quickly browse the list you can find all the terms acupuncture and low back pain and all the titles so acupuncture and low back pain those terms are directly linked to their research questions and research topics so they included them in the title and PubMed only shows the articles which include these terms so this is the most specific way you can use By using these tags, you can zoom in or zoom out freely, making specific, more, or sensitive. Okay, there are many tags, but these three tags are extremely useful. These three tags make your PubMed search way more efficient and more enjoyable. Okay, good luck with your PubMed.